Hi everyone, I'm Carly Bell and I am live at the Applique Getaway um, tonight here in Dallas, Texas. And I was doing a live a little while ago, but the signal is not good. So I'm just gonna record a video for y'all now and show you around the vendor's room and all the good stuff that I'm gonna spend all my money on. <laughs> so when the live ended, I was trying to show you around Love That Cotton. Let me turn you around in case, oh, I can't flip the camera. Okay, um, let me show you around in case that did not come out good. But this is Love That Cotton. Beautiful, beautiful blanks. I hit up the sale bin, clearance bin back here. I got a bunch of cute stuff for $5. Um, but they have all the pretty things, all of the, the baby rompers and sunsuits and seersucker dresses and towels and ev all the things. So you could spend a million dollars here very easily. Um, and then also, you know, all the cute shirts and dresses. So these are like the more boutique, I would say, type items you could see up here you know, for those special events. And also, these are the kind of things people like in Etsy shops, you know? Um, the things that are a little bit more rare, the, not the stuff you see every day. Um, that is the kind of stuff I think that sells really well in Etsy shops and you can ask a higher price for. So the next booth, I never went in yet. Let's see, but they have a big Milko machine they're demonstrating and they have thread and Trouble Be Not embroidery by Bravo. So I think this is all about Milko. Um, embroidery machines and they also talk a little bit about Mighty Hoops too. Um, next we have Bella Blue Embroidery and uh, she has really cute embroidery designs. I want, to say, I want to say I watched her video last year when the applique uh, getaway was virtual and she showed the little cute Elf on the Shelf sweaters that you can make for your um, Elf on the Shelf. Uh, let's see, let's keep going. Now what at Lander Design and Amazing Grace Design. So they have really cute designs that are incorporated into quilts, into a block, and they also have a few blanks and bags. So there's some good stuff. Okay, so now we're getting to now we're getting to the fun part. This oh, it's not glitter blood, it's glitter bug berry. Okay, so this is one of my favorite spots in this show. Um, in, in this vendor show. And they show you some examples of mini ears that they make with their vinyl. So super duper cute stuff. All the cute little hardware, tassels, zippers, and then lots of examples of bags that you can make. And then here is all the vinyl. So here's that adult sheet I was telling you about. You could get a package of that. And then they have just all the samples, all the samples. And then these are those individual sheets that I got a few of, and then rolls of everything. So this is an awesome shop for y'all to check out, Glitter Bug Fairy. Let's see, I, yeah, I definitely went crazy in there. <laughs> all right, oh, Bayou Blanks. This is a really another uh, another great blank company. Um, all the cute fear sucker bags, like all, like all of them. They have the, the kitty backpacks, kitty lunch kit, the weekender bag, and they're not bad at all. That big giant weekender bag is only 20 bucks. Yeah, so look how nice that is. And you can, I mean, that just looks so nice. Um, lots of cute little seersucker things for the kids. Bubbles and dresses, all kinds of cute stuff. And they have a few Christmas pajamas. So that is all good. I know the little, um, the seersucker backpacks are really popular with the kids. So those are super popular for like the preschoolers um, and uh, as diaper bags as well. Okay, let's see. It's really gotten thin in here. It was packed earlier. Um, then we have a brother um, store is here and they're showing off all the lovely brother machines. How y'all doing? And let's see, this one I didn't come to. This is, says learn to sew with me. I don't know who it is. This is somebody's booth. Oh, hi. <laughs> What's the name of your company? Big B Applique. Say again? Big B Applique. Big B Applique. I think I'm taking a class with you. I'm doing, I have a YouTube channel, so I'm just showing around the, uh, 
the um, the show and showing everybody what it's like to come here. So thank you. We were shopping. <laughs> All right. So let's see. We have our friend from String uh, Theory app. Uh, Okay. This is another really good company. This is all about joint. So this is a website and you can see their um, business card up there. And they have really good towels, um, bags. I don't know if you can see those up there. Um, they have the garden flag. They have a few um, beautiful kid linen dresses. Um, if you can see those. And they also had a few cubbies um, on clearance. So lots of cute stuff here from All About Blanks. Let's see, where are we at? Oh, Lenny Penny. I took a class with Lenny Penny today and it was awesome. So she is showing off all of her designs and she's teaching digitizing classes on how to really create a well done digitized design. Let's see, where are we going next? Yeah, look how cute. And she showed us how to do stuff with Mylar, which I really want to do. All right, then we have a Bernina and Janome um, dealer showing off some machines there. And next we have, let's see, who's this? Really cute stuff, but I don't remember the name. Um, here we go, embroidery design. Oh, pegboard crafts, here we go. These pegboard crafts, and they have really cute in the hoop designs. So they show examples of all their in the hoop designs and then you can just go and buy the digital design and they have uh, specials where you like buy three designs and get one free. So it's nice because it's, it shows you an in-person example of what your design should stitch out as. And look at this adorable mobile. Look how cute all of these, these are all in the booth. Little projects. And then made in, uh, in there. They got four hangers there, all kinds of cute stuff. So that's a really cute company. And I was telling y'all earlier about the little pink heat press. So that is there, and that's where I got my t-shirt, and then I think that's about it. They had, um, they had like a, a business called Coastal Business Supplies, and they're showing, um, I think, sublimation and direct-to-garment printing. So they have some demonstrations of machines for that, and heat presses, so all that good stuff. <laughs> Uh, so that's a company we can check out too for those sublimation and other cool ways of customizing. Oh no, I'll, I'll stitch up by Angela has all kind of good. That's where I got my first koozie and I really like the quality of her koozie. Um, look, this is a, one of the koozies I made the girls. So her sublimation koozies, they're really thick and they're more that neoprene where the ones I got on Amazon were the foam. So these are a lot better. I love that heat tape and let's see. I think these are for laser engraving blanks. Okay. That's, that's gonna be Carol. Carol's got the laser engraver we gotta play with. And then these are all sublimation blanks. So all of this fun stuff. Well, they even have patches. It's like a patch. That's cute. So um, all kinds of cute stuff. And they have some cups up there. So, all the cute things. Oh, oh, Sherry's making a shirt. Let's see. Let's see your shirt. I'm lift it up. Isn't that the cutest pink heat and press? Then, then you're gonna feel that paper fast. You burned it. Feel it. Like feel it. Feel it. Feel it. <laughs> Woo! Yay! Yay. Show us your shirt. Yay! <laughs> awesome. awesome. Thank you. All right. Okay. I think I showed around all the boots. You need to go to Gail. Gail. We never She's went to Gail. What does she have?
talk to Lisa. You think Lisa will talk to us? Okay. We'll see. We'll see. I might say a girl up. <laughs> How y'all doing? This is um, Crafting Besties. They have the best sublimation paper. So that's one that we can check out too with the new sublimation printer. Lisa is really busy. She, she's had a line at her booth all day. Oh, but in good news, I did go up to the booth. I didn't get to talk to Lisa. I talked to another um, very nice lady that was very helpful. And I asked her uh, an embrilliant question that I have with when we do in the hoop projects. And I want to, I open up the in the hoop bag design and I want to put a name on it, but that means I need I should be moving the name up and it not be the last step, right? If you want to do it in the proper order to where the last step is your tack down of the bag or, you know, if the name needs to be in the middle of the design or not the, or the second to last stitch. Whenever I move it, the um, there's stitches missing when I put the design on my machine. And so the nice lady at the Ambrillion's booth told me I may need to turn off the feature, remove hidden stitches. Because when we reorder, the design, now that placement stitch and that tack down stitch that was right on top of each other might be considered um, hidden stitches underneath and they're removing them. And that's why the designs are getting messed up. So that's something I'm gonna try when I get home or get to play with my computer. So Lisa's really busy. I don't think we're gonna get to talk to her. <laughs> so let's see, I think that's it then. So. Um, thank you so much to the to everyone that tried that tried watching the live. I'm sorry if it kept uh, refreshing and freezing, and I don't I have no clue how the sound is. I hope it's half decent. <laughs> so thank you to everyone who joined us tonight at the applique getaway. Um, I will be back in my craft room on Friday, August 6th, I think, and we're gonna do a back to school project. I'm pretty sure I have it picked out, but. Let me not say it because I might, I might change my mind. You never know. <laughs> but it's going to be a back-to-school themed project. So until then, y'all take care. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of y'all. And have a great weekend. Bye.